Imagine having lost your family members to a terror attack and left a widower and finally meeting the man responsible for the attack that claimed the lives of your kin. This is a story depicted by Itifaki, a feature film. Here now is Jacqueline Masharia with a review of the film in our weekly segment, Cinemas and Theatre. Itifaki, a Swahili word for protocol, is a short story of a grieving widower Makena who infiltrates the life of the man responsible for the bus bombing that claimed the lives of his family. Posing as a potential buyer for his house, McKenna engages in a deadly confrontation with John, leading to a climatic battle where their fates intertwine. Their fight for survival uncovers the depths of their inner strength, leading to a final release of grief and justice. Itifaki is directed and produced by Omar Hamza and co-produced by Jun Wairegi. Omar notes the short film was a proof of concept for a later feature film. Essentially what we wanted to do was to film an action scene to enable it as a count screen if we put our weight onto it. Uh, but we couldn't just fin shoot an action scene peke to evil. So we had to develop a small story around the action scene. So that's how the Itifaki short film offshoot happened. The filmmakers describe that despite the cast members being dedicated to their craft, casting for an action feature film is not easy. Casting for an action film is quite hard. Um, because you, you need someone when you a work to visit, but you also need someone who's physically fit enough to do the stunts and stuff. Uh, because uh, unfortunately in Kenya there are not that many stuntmen. Like people who just come in and do the stunt and not work. So you have to find actors that can do both, can act and do stunts. We had to first get the cast members in line with the thinking that we had in the original concept. Luckily for us, the stunt coordinator and the actors had worked together on um, actually a KBC show, um, Pakani. Having produced other films before, the filmmakers note the film Itifaki stretched them in different ways. How you cast for an action film is different on how you cast for, for drama, as I've said before. How you shoot it, how you frame it, how you edit it, it's, it's, uh, it's quite different from, from dramas, I would say. This was a whole different animal because we had stunt coordination, we had to think about the safety of the cast, we had to think about the space and how um, the cast was going to fight in the space. So the, the real challenge there was working with a small space, like two very big men in a very confined space without having any major injuries. The emergency of the streaming services kind of helping the industry, like in Showmax and Netflix. And also the KFC has stepped up in a big way. If we pulled our money, to proper projects. So the first thing I think should happen is writers. Primarily as a writer, that's what I feel that the industry is currently um, lacking in. So you can watch the film um, on our YouTube channel. Uh, it's at Giza Visuals. You can find us on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, across the social media platforms at Giza Visuals. Jackie Masharia for Cinemas and Peter.